Hey everyone, thank you so much for stopping by. Today we'll be using Leota Machida in the light heavyweight division. And if you watched the very first video that I made on Leota Machida in this game, I complained quite a bit about Leoto. I did not think that he was done justice at all in the game, but it does seem like Leota Machida has been upgraded quite a bit. As you can see right there, he has got 97 stand up. I believe that is the highest stand-up rating in the light heavyweight division. So that is that is quite a bump. And I'm very curious to see how Leota Machida plays right now in the game. Now, when I first used him, I used him in the middleweight division. And maybe that was a mistake. But for this fight, we'll be going light heavyweight. And we'll see exactly how we do. Let's see if Leota Machida can compete. I mean, he should be able to, especially if the fight is on the feet, considering how nasty his stand-up is supposed to be right now so let's see who we're facing we're facing john jones there's no surprise there no surprise whatsoever um the first few rounds as always when you're facing john jones you will be dealing with some combinations all kinds of strikes uh jumping side kicks side kicks to the body switch kicks to the head leg kicks you'll be dealing with clinch attempts you'll be dealing with takedown attempts there's a lot to worry about when you're facing John Jones. So the first few rounds, I'm just going to try to keep my stamina up, try to avoid damage. And then in the later rounds, I'm going to see if I can get this guy out of here. This is going to be a five round fight. It is a championship fight. Exactly. Already started. So let's just, just try to avoid getting hit. That's just what we need to try to work on. Avoid getting hit. Let him gas himself out a little bit, throwing all these combinations. All right, don't push, don't push, it's okay. Don't push because they're gonna back up and start doing that, exactly. Yep, just be careful, no matter what. They break. All right, just take it easy. Yeah, all right, calm down. Calm down. Powerful kick. Big elbow. elbow. All right. Like I always say those switches to the head. That kick is very difficult to deal with. I have no idea how he keeps getting the clinch. That tie clinch again. And We're out. The huge head kick is blocked. Done over the Caught him with that one. Oh, he lands the roundhouse the Good one too. Nope, I'm not gonna push. The second they start backing up to the cage, that's when the switch starts coming. It's coming. There's a big right overhand by Machida. Body kick. We're hitting him. Wow, what a powerful leg kick that was. Oh, He's hurt. Big power jab. You can tell that body shot hurt him bad. Oh, and another jab. He's peeing off with some vicious Pushing shots. forward a little bit. While staying careful. There's a left that connects. This all oh, big body. It's coming. Yeah. Back up. Let him let him throw. I don't I don't want to get rocked by something crazy. Jones with a solid straight. Come up. That was a vicious knee that he just blocked. Alright. Gets away from the clinch. Big round. Body kick missed. Head kick. Missed that one. Jones, of course, is so long. Body kick missed. Alright. First round is pretty good. I think Leota feels good. He's moving well. His kick speed is good. His punch speed is good. I'm feeling the power. I'm de I definitely feel more powerful than John Jones. The only issue is that John has a lot of these really 
crazy long strikes that he can land from a distance and those strikes are very dangerous they're significant strikes so you got to be careful with that but when i do touch john jones when i when i hit him i can feel the power i can definitely feel that my fighter is more powerful than john jones and when it comes to punches leota machida is more powerful than john jones of course overall as a fighter he is not more powerful than than john jones but when it comes to punches he is what's going on all right, here we go. I think John is the most powerful fighter. Well, he's not more powerful than Anthony Johnson in the light heavyweight division, but he comes second in that division when it comes to like overall power. Ford. See, it's like even even when you're hitting them. Nice kick, Joe. Those shots to the legs are really starting to take their toll on Jones. And Joe, we take a look at the Oh, his legs is hurt. I had no clue. Cut him on the head kick. Machida with a kick to the back. Good maneuvers here to avoid clinching. Nice kick. Big power in that kick. Good double jab. Kick lands the left. He's hurt. He, not, not, not easy to finish him. He's hurt again. Push him back. Come on, we gotta finish this dude. Boy, oh boy. Solid right hand. Big punch. Nice jab. Big straight punch. And he got right to the left hand. Hand. Trying to stay out of trouble here. Okay. He goes for a takedown. Switch to backside. That's how difficult it is to finish John Bones Jones. We still have to be careful. Nice leg kick. I like that, Mike. I like how he's Not to get rocked with anything. Oh, he missed that kick. When I get him out of there, it's going to be emphatic. Missed. Switch. Nice block by Machito. Going for the elbows now. Hard kick Caught him with the head kick. Nice kick to the body. Head kick. He hurt him with that punch in the clinch. Get him out of there. Oh, solid Jab straight. straight. All right, this round is over. John is getting destroyed, bro. Getting destroyed, but I haven't been able to drop him yet. Here's a powerful leg kick. Haven't been able to drop him just yet, but we'll drop him. We'll we'll finish him. We'll get him out of there eventually somehow. I just have to be careful. I have to be careful. He's got a couple inches on me. That jumping switch kick is very deadly, very dangerous, even when they don't have any stamina. Put him with the head kick. Was able to defend against that head kick right there. Let's get up. I want to get, get back up. I want to get back up. Alright, let's get back up to my feet. Go. Man, he can't take too many of those body shots. Nice shots here. 
Joe, you can see the effects of those body shots. There's a ton of bruising on his Straight. Right he's dropped. Let's let him up. It's over. Is it? I want to. I want to get a knockout. Get a knockout. Yo. This fight could be over very soon. Left, right. Good kick to the body by John. Jones eats another big punch, but he seems unfazed. Unbelievable. Head kick. <laughs> oh my god, bro. Protected here, excellent blocking. Good work blocking that. Oh, oh big right oh, hand. Yeah. Come on, that's it. That's got to be it. Come on, that's got to be it. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, bro. <laughs> oh my goodness. I did not want a TKO. I did not want a TKO. All right, KO. We got him out of there. Head kick. Straight punch, dropped him. But I mean, that just goes to show how long you can survive with Johnny Bones Jones just throwing wild strikes pretty impressive but my verdict on Leona Machida is he's powerful he really really is he he feels damn near as powerful as Anthony Johnson to me his striking is fluid he is fast enough um his footwork feels amazing to me it, he, he is very very competitive very competitive now in the hands of a better player I'm pretty sure I would lose to John Jones because just because of the height difference it will be very difficult to reach him because the other Michida and he's about six foot one. But um, apart from that, he is very he's very good. I I really 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 enjoy this fight. So let me know in the comment section if you guys have used Machida and what do you think about Leo Machida, and uh, we'll go from there. Thank you so much for watching, guys. It means a lot to me, and I will see you guys in the next in the next video. As always, be safe and thank you for watching.